Hello my dear friends, welcome to our channel 59 code. My name is Sonu Sagar. So in this video, firstly I am going to give you a question. If you know answer of this question, then write in below comment box. So in this video, we are going to download PyCharm IDE. IDE it means integrated development environment in which you can write programs like Python, C, C++. For every language, there are different types of IDE available. But in this video, we are going to download IDE for especially Python, that is PyCharm. So if you are not subscribe our channel, then firstly subscribe it and click on bell icon and select all. So let's start. Firstly, you need to go on browser. I am open my default browser that is Google Chrome and in this you need to search in search box by charm download and press enter after it in first you can see a website of which is jetbrains.com click here this type of interface comes after clicking there now download PyCharm here in windows option there are two types of PyCharm available first is professional and second is community version in professional you need to pay some money for download it and in community version you can download it totally free what is the difference between professional and community if you know then write in comment box so in professional you can add it uh, like html js and sql like markup language or programming language also but in community version you can add it pure python program you can develop only pure python program it is especially for python language so for download this click here on download button and after clicking here your download is a start I am already download it so click on show in folder so this is our PyCharm community so install it firstly double click on it after clicking here this pop up will show here click on next button and again click on next button and this part is a very important part there are four checkbox in this pop up firstly is create desktop shortcut you can check it if you want to create shortcut on your desktop and second is update content menu in this update content menu add open folder as uh, it means like this when you click here right button then here comes open with code after you click this checkbox then after clicking right button you can see your PyCharm editor and open directly in your folder so for this click here and create association it means dot py it is the extension of python so also click here and update path variable if you check this checkbox then you no need to update your path location on going to environment variable option it set your path itself so after this click on next button and here already selected jetbrains so install it will take some time for installation if you stay till last of our video then in the last part we are going to write a simple program and also execute that in this IDE so wait wait for last moment so now here completing PyCharm community addition setup here PyCharm want to reboot your system then, then click reboot now and click finish after reboot we meet again after you start your system you can see here icon of PyCharm community available right click here then also here open folder as PyCharm community both are come here and after it we need to open this software for that double click here it will take some time for opening now here one pop up so 
community terms and condition so if you are able then uh, read this all terms and condition after it click here and go for continue it will ask you for data sharing so in this time and cut this redirect page read you can see here that it's our pycharm software open and after open this click here new project new project you need to set path of this folder or this new project for set click here and select a folder in this case i'm going with e partition which going in coding folder after it here create a new directory which name is pycharm and click ok and select this folder and click ok your path will be set and after it you need to create after waiting some moment your id will be ready for start working main.py already written here cut this file then go on new and in new uh, click on python file so here give you a, a name which is first quote dot py last of your name of file you must need to apply dot py this is python extension same as like for html markup language dot html is the extension and for javascript js is extension like that python for python programming language dot py is the extension of python so after it click here and press enter then you come in new file uh, we need to try for writing some code and after it execute so now i am going to write some simple programs like calling of print function and in this pass a string that is hello so i am writing in print function hello welcome to 59 code so for run this there is a option for run and when you go on this file so when you click on this first code dot py right click then here a option run and from here or here also you can run this code go on this uh, uh, file code dot first code dot py file and click right click and after this run here and now you can see output of this program will be so here hello welcome to 59 code so this is enough for this for the first video of python in which we download python ide that is pycharm so in upcoming video we also call a start coding in python and we create awesome projects using python so so if you are not subscribe our channel then firstly subscribe it and go on our channel and watch our previous videos and enjoy meet again in next video and thanks for watching this video till last if you watch this video till last then you can write down in comment box that i am watching your video till last